as you can see we're gonna be doing some more broken sword sleeping dragon you know it's one of those things where i started with this game and like when i started streaming i was playing this game and i'm, I'm kind of a completionist so i don't really want to just like ignore this game um so you know those of you probably were hoping i'd put some smash though now that i think about it i believe my stream is telling people i'm playing smash so i might need to update that yep it is all right let me update that so i do apologize for the delay Okay. Now, <laughs> now I should have the correct uh, header information. So, whoopsie do there. But my controller keeps getting caught on a ledge. Sorry about that. Alright. Let's actually run with it now. Alright, so let's get back into this. I plan to I plan to beat this game one way or another. I'm coming, I'm coming for you. Alright, so back to playing George. Uh, we're still in this castle in Prague. Uh, last I played as Nico, uh, I found a, a disguise to make me look like Petra, but then it, um, you know, I got stopped by some guards, so they kind of left me to play as George. So let's go ahead and continue on. I, uh, I thought about playing some Smash Brothers, but, uh, I wasn't, I'm not feeling too well right now. My, uh, I ate a lot of food, so my stomach's kind of like, Ugh, so I just don't know if I have the mental capacity to try and take people down in Smash, but don't worry, uh, Smash Brothers will return. Um, I'm planning to make um, a day of the week dedicated to Smash stream, so look for that. Uh, I want to say that's going to be on Sundays. So anytime I stream on a Sunday, uh, it is going to be to play Smash Brothers. So if you're looking for me to play Smash, that's the day to look for it. And <laughs> thank you, Hypna. I uh, I'm trying, trying to upgrade my, my 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 team here. But yeah, if you wanna if you wanna play me in some Smash Brothers, then look for that on Sundays, uh, in the evening time. Other than that, there may be some, depending on my day to day, there might be some random pop ups of, of Smash Brothers here and there. And you know, I'll continue to play some Broken Sword as I work through completing this game. <sighs> And I'll slowly add in some other games. I recently had a birthday. So I got a bunch of games for that. Mostly console games for like PlayStation and Switch. So I could hop, I could, you know, start playing some of those. So those might be a lot of fun. I got, um, so I got Monster Hunter Iceborne. So that could be a lot of fun to get back into Monster Hunter. I did beat the main story of the original game, but... I never picked up ice board. Either yet, the so door was stuck or it was just locked. So that should be a lot of fun. I couldn't hear anything. I also got uh dragon. The door Quest looked 11. sturdy. Alright, so this door is not doing much for me. Looks like I can climb over the ledge here. But yeah, I got Monster Hunter Iceborne, Dragon Quest Eleven for Switch. Uh, River, a game called River City Girls for Switch. It's a limited run game. Ooh, what's this? The gargoyle was damaged by years of rain and wind. It looked as if it would fall off with just a gentle push. Push it. Push I'm it. all for conservation, but push needs it. must if the devil drives. Push it. Push it. <clears throat> and there it goes. Um, what else I got? Oh, I also got Jedi Fallen Order. Uh, I've gotten... Look up a photo right now. I got a new uh, Yeti microphone that I'm using right now, so hopefully I sound really clear. 
Oh, I got Shadow of the Colossus, the remake for PS4, and uh, Code Vein. So there's definitely some some fun games we can get into streaming there at some point. But I uh, I'm a completionist, so I don't want to I don't want to leave Broken Sword unfinished, especially if there's anybody watching that wanted to check it out. Plus, all these videos get uploaded to my YouTube channel, so I feel a little awkward having kind of an incomplete walkthrough of a game. Uh, now, if, I mean, don't get me wrong, I'm open to suggestions, so if a bunch of people hop in this room and it's like, play Smash Brothers, play Smash Brothers, then I'm open to swapping over to Smash Brothers. Like to at least get a bit of this game in. Push this There's only so much you can do with a gargoyle, so I decided to leave it alone. What? I can't. Why can't I push this one over? Well, now what? Do I like go down the ledge? Checking something. Hmm. Now what? Wait. Okay, there we go. I mean, retrospect. Hypno, you still watching? The lamp had an old knob that I guessed was for turning it on. Oh, yuck. At least the knob worked. Ew, it's now dripping. As soon as I turned the knob, the oil stopped dripping. Good old crate puzzles. Hmm. That didn't work. Go and push that into the hole. That way. Stupid door. Silence. That was either a sign, or there was just no one behind the door. The door had no remarkable features. The oil started to drip again. <sighs> Ugh, my stomach's killed the right oil now. dripping onto the floor was a fire hazard. So I gotta figure out this crate puzzle, apparently. Nope, not what I wanted. Ok, 
Okay. It kind of worked. find a way to make an opening. This makes the most sense to me right now. I think this helps? Yeah. Cool. Must get out of this castle. I'll say this game, Broken Sword 3, definitely feels a lot longer in comparison to Broken Sword. One and two did, and I don't know if that was just like a graphical design or like just how much you could really pack into a game. That door wasn't going to open. The grate only opened a little way. The hinges were badly rusted. There had to be a way to free those hinges. There was an old iron grate set into the floor. Below it was a pit with a window that led into the castle. There was a chance that I could have got through there if I lifted the grate. What's this? The old drain pipe ran up the wall, but looked like it was broken. Hmm. Just as well, the pipe was wet and slimy. It was an old drain pipe, rusted and bent. An offshoot pipe had been blocked by an old tin cup. Now I can pick something up. Got an old tin cup. Maybe I can use the tin cup to get some oil for the dripping oil. Well, you know, because the bars are rusty. Sometimes oil can help grease those bars. I'm starting to think I shouldn't stream uh, Broken Sword because doing Smash Brothers definitely had more of a fan base to it. But, you know, I want to mix it up. I don't want to just be a one trick pony when it comes to the games I play. The oil started Oof. to drip again. Oh, man. All right, let's try this. I collected a small amount of oil in the old cup. Nice. The oil dripping onto the floor was a fire hazard. All right, my bad. I should have turned it off. To a wall. All right, let's see if the oil is enough. I hope the oil would free the hinges. I could almost hear the hinges sighing with relief. Woohoo! So banana. Here it goes. <laughs> Title sprang to mind. A thousand and one uses for lamp oil. What? 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 What do you mean my thoughts on the on the Iran Contra affair? Madame Petra, we didn't hear you arrive. What? Obviously. And did you have a pleasant journey? No. 
Now get back to your jobs, both of you. Uh, our apologies, ma'am. Security is too lax around here. Yes, ma'am. What rules are you Your breaking? belongings have been taken up to your apartment. Good. <sighs> Miserable bitch. Ooh, that's rough. Trying to find... Let me know if my microphone starts to sound odd. I've kind of repositioned it because I think my, my hand was getting cut out by the corner of it. All right, so we're back to playing as Nico disguised as Petra. So let's continue our journey. What's your job here? To make sure that no one gets through the front entrance, ma'am. I fought the urge to tell him to drop and give me 20. How many men do we have on the grounds? A double compliment on the perimeter, ma'am. No one gets in or out without us knowing. Guaranteed. If that was his idea of a guarantee, I wasn't shopping for watches locally. Mm -hmm. What's this door? The security door had no handle or visible way of opening it, but there was a card reader on the wall. I needed a working key card to open the door. I should turn on my fan. It's like really hot in here. Let's see. Maybe this guy knows something about the door. Just some delivery notes. Some were for food, others for washing powder. I would have hated to do the laundry for this lot. Me too. I guess I can't talk to this guy? Okay. Any news? It's been pretty quiet. What about an attack from inside? Everything is buttoned down tight. Good. Now, would you care to explain why you are reading on duty? Just trying to improve myself, ma'am. Do it again, and the next book you buy will be in Braille. Yes, ma'am. Sorry, ma'am. The security door over there. Could anyone get through it? No, ma'am. It's the most secure there is. Oh, by the way, ma'am, have you had a chance to see the security sergeant yet? No. I shall get his report in good time. He's waiting to issue you with your security card. That's oh. convenient. Where can I find him? He's checking the perimeter, so he's somewhere outside. Thank you. Hmm. Where was the prisoner taken? To Senor Suzara's office in the lower levels. Is he on his own? Two guards went with him, ma'am. He cannot escape. For your sake, he'd better not. Alright. So I should go out to the courtyard to try and find my security card. Hello. I wonder if you can help me. Are you Madame Petra? That's right. How can I help you, ma'am? That's a very fierce-looking dog. Train to kill as soon as he's released, ma'am. Good. Just don't release him near me. Understand? No, ma'am. You hear that, rascal? You're not to hurt the nice lady. Rascal? You! I need some help. You're Madame Petra, isn't that right? No, I'm Madonna. Whoa! Idiot! Of course I'm Madame Petra! What a disgusting dog! Thank you, ma'am. What's his name? Raptor. How appropriate! More appropriate Raptor. than a rascal. This is true. Maybe this is the guy? This place is a mess. I'm sorry, ma'am. I don't know you. I am Madame Petra. Isn't it obvious? Of course, ma'am. Uh, I should have realized. Nope. Not that guy. Maybe this Who guy. are you? Come on. I haven't got all day. 
Sergeant of security, ma'am. Hey, there he is. I am Madame Petra. I have just arrived. Of course, ma'am. I have a security card for you. Here you are. Yeah, but... Thanks. Cool. So I'm guessing I can now. That was weird. Anyway, I'm guessing now we can go through that security door. So let's do that. The card didn't work. Uh, pardon me, Madame Petra, but you need to get the card validated. Yes, yes, of course. Somebody should have told me that. Just checking security is watertight. So how do I get it validated? Can you tell me? I have some questions. Apparently not. Not this time. How do I get it validated? Everything all right? Bit uh, nervous, ma'am. It's my first day on the job. Just make sure no one gets in, and it won't be your last. Going blonde had brought out the mean streak in me. I rather enjoyed it. Oh, Nico. Nico, my darling. You see this pencil? Yes, ma'am. There are 15 ways I can kill a man using this. Yes, ma'am. Sorry, ma'am. I guess time to explore for a security room. This might be the security room. There's a lot of doors. I didn't really want to go messing with things I didn't know about. Can help me? Excuse me. Please, ma'am, do not interrupt me. I cannot afford mistakes. I need you to answer a few questions. What exactly is it that you are doing? I'm sorry, ma'am. I have strict instructions to report only to Senor Suzaro until we have finished our preparations for the armillary. Yes, of course. Hard asses. This card required validating. Could you do that for me? Of course, ma'am. Gotta love the animation. Tch. So rude. There you are. Now please excuse me, Madame Petra. I must get on with my work. Senor Suzaro will be very upset if I don't finish this. Okay, give me my card. Alright, now I think I can enter that room. So let's try this again. That wasn't the right thing to do. Damn. Icon on top of Icon. After what I'd been through to get the card, I was desperate to see what lurked down below. The cell was locked and empty. It was an old prison cell. Hmm. Damn, this must have been where Bruno was being held. I hoped I wasn't too late. Oh no, someone was coming. But aren't I allowed down here? Technically? And we're back to George. I'm in a lunchroom. 
I knew that stealing putrid socks wouldn't solve anything. There's been a lot of switching between Georgia and Nico, I've noticed. Wait. Oh, apparently I can move this one. I didn't need to take any of the washing powder. Why not? The door was locked. This was beginning to feel more and more like a prison. There had to be some way of opening the door. Maybe break it? Hmm. I feel like I have the right idea, but not enough force behind it. Come on, George. You're only a little bit stronger. Well, the only thing I can think of would be to move this washing machine onto that trolley. It's the only other item I can really interact with inside this uh, conjurer. So let's just do that. Probably have to shift it over some more. The washing machine slid sweetly onto the trolley. Uh, I think we have the right idea. Now I get to take the scenic route. Oh, damn tank controls. Ugh. Game plays like ass. Well, so I gotta use here it goes. <laughs> nice. Yes! Looks like the same place Nico's in, or Nico was in. So maybe, maybe that shadowy figure turning the corner was actually George. It's like another room with a key card. Ah, oh, it was no use. The door was shut tight. If only I had the key card to open it. Foreshadowing. Take that, you! Oh, why you? George? Who? It's me, Nico. Jeez, I thought you were Petra. Hmm. Often sneak up on girls like that, do you? Only blondes. So it's true. They do have more fun. Hang on to the wig and find out. Trailer trash chic. Not really my style. Oof. Ouch. So how come you're down Hardcore. here? Did you notice the extra security? I'm guessing that Bruno must be close. So what are we waiting for? Have we been reunited? I think we've been reunited. Also, I feel inclined to save. But sometimes I forget how much this game randomly freeze in the middle of something, so... Hey, Nico. Yes, George? I have to admit, the blonde hair is a bit strange. Oh, really? Nobody said anything. That's because the outfit's so scary. They're all terrified of you. So, did you find Bruno? No, I don't know where he could be. The guards in the entrance hall said that he had been moved to Cesaro's office. Down here somewhere. Alright. Damn! What are you doing? Shh! Guards! They're guarding a door over there. Damn. That's got to be where Bruno is. I could get past, but you would be shot if you tried. You need to find a way to fool them. Uh. All right. Time to investigate the different parts of the tunnel. Not a whole lot down here.
I mean, the only thing I can think of is um, maybe Nico's key card works on the door. Hey, Nico, can you do something with this lock? I don't have anything to open it. Hey, this makes some sense to me. Seems like it's working. Where would you be without me, George? Underground, six feet, probably dead, probably dead. Ooh, ooh, ooh. do I get to put on a disguise now? Ugh. Probably, it's the only thing I can interact with. Well, this should Let's help sleep. me move around more easily. Nico, could you turn your back, please? You are joking. I know, but it's these shorts. Not very flattering. Oh, fine. Quickly, get it over and done with. There, changed. Oh, you look nice. I <laughs> bet you say that to all the guards. <laughs> all right. Now I'm like one of them. I just need to speak in a Russian accent, which I can't do accents. I'm not very good at them. I know that was more the right. British one. Here goes. Very really good. I wonder if he's going to try to imitate an accent. Madame Petra, I wasn't informed you were back. As you can see, I am. And this is urgent. I ought to check with the front desk. You are holding me up. Now, unless you want your appendages rearranging, I suggest you open the door. Of course, ma'am. My apologies. Yeah. Didn't even have to say anything. Alright, so far so good. Another door. It was a large metal door with a numeric keypad to one side. Hmm. Probably can't use your keycard for that one. What's that say? I was not expecting that. <laughs> oh, happened again. I mean, the only thing I can think of is to move these crates so I can get to the uh, metal grating at the top. Good to see you guys. Ugh, crap. <laughs> oh, it's happening again. I'm really sorry. There's a lot of people on stream. Well, it's happening. Why does he keep happening? <sighs> Alright, I need to... Wait. Wait, that one went away. <coughs> no, dude! No, <sighs> Uh. 
think I finally. Oh, I just stopped sneezing. Nico, keep quiet and come and look at this. It's Bruno. I don't think there's anyone in there with him. Can we risk it? We've got to. Hey, Bruno. Bruno, it's Nico. And George. Hey, fellas, nice of you to drop by. Are you okay? Oh, sure. I'm thirsty, I'm hungry, I'm in constant pain. I've had more electricity through me than a small town in winter. But heck, now you're here, who gives a damn? You're, you're so here. brave. Lady, I grew up in Eastern Europe. We did torture Ooh, in sorry. kindergarten. Have you told them anything? <sighs> Everything. But the one thing Susaro wants. And what's that? Who has got the key of Solomon? But we don't know who's got it. Exactly. Well, it doesn't matter now. We're coming in to... Shh. That was the gatehouse. Petra has arrived at last. I am so pleased for you. Thank you. I find torture such a soulless task without an audience. Oh, I know. And she is so imaginative. Such a source of new ideas. I appreciate that. Yes, Bruno, I truly believe you will. And look on the bright side. When you tell us who has the key, even then we will not kill you. We need you too much. My dear girl. Has he talked yet? No, but I'm sure you will persuade him. I'm going to enjoy it. Now, Stobart and the girl. I hope you bring me good news. I found them, but I'm afraid they got away. I'm sorry. They have too much luck. That is worse, Master. Let him in. All right, boss. Not this idiot. Forgive me, sir, but there is something you must hear. Flap. Tell Senor Suzaro what you told me in Paris. What? About that nightclub? And those girls? No, no, no. About the safe. Oh, yeah. Well, it wasn't, was it? Wasn't what? Wasn't safe? Get on with it, Flap. That Stobart girl. She came back to the theater. Took some documents. What documents? A picture of a castle in Prague. This castle. Very good! Give the man a cigar! Flap! Well, sorry, sir. Wait, what is that? Do you like it? It's my new scarf. That Stobart girl left it behind in Paris. What is it? You can go, Flap. Get out! Thank you, sir. Well, Bruno, it's your lucky day. What's just happened? Now I know who has the key. We do not need to put Petra to work on you. You know? How? The emblem on the scarf. It is the crest of the Saint Stephen chapter of the Knights Templar. Uh-oh. I thought they had disappeared centuries ago. Clearly not. And I know exactly where to find them. That fool Flap had the answer all along, wrapped round his thick neck. Carl must be working for them. So, now we must change our plans. I shall go to Paris to retrieve the key. You take Ostwald to the armillary to prepare. Give the order that all personnel are to prepare to move out. It's time, isn't it? Yes, my dear. It is time. It is time. Grill looked through to some kind of office. It could give access if the grill itself wasn't in the way. Wee.
the grill was screwed tight to the wall. I wasn't going to be able to pull it off with my hands. Alright, so I can't use my hands. Now what? I guess I check my items. Let's see, probably not. Probably not. Probably not. Hmm. I got all this stuff in my inventory and like none of it's useful. Damn point and click adventure games. Uh maybe the coin? The edge of the coin was just the right size to unfasten the screws. Hey, I've used coins the haven't you ever used the coin to unfasten a screw? It makes perfect sense. Sometimes you gotta think real world logic when you when you do these puzzles. I couldn't get through the narrow gap. Then what was the whole um, point? George, when I first knew you, that would have been no problem. Oh, cold. Guess I must be carrying a little more muscle, huh? <laughs> Ooh, that's yeah, cold. the fat kind. Okay. Uh, Look, whatever I said about you in that wig, I apologize. Apology accepted. Phew. Won't make you any thinner, though. That hurts. Okay, maybe she can go through. Uh, Nico? Yes. I don't like to ask, but would I climb through the grill and open the door from the inside? Yeah. Amazing. Much that. You read my mind. You're just so predictable, George. <sighs> Come on, Nico. Get on up. Get on up. Get on up. You owe me one. That's okay. I'm not counting. <laughs> All right, through the door. Nico, look. Whoa. It's some kind of map of ley lines. See the area in the it's middle. Always ley lines. It matches the diagram Every in time. Vernon's video. It's ley lines. It seems to have its focus somewhere in Egypt. Ooh, we're going to so Egypt. So do you think that's where they've taken Bruno? Well, I think so. The armillary must be in Egypt. Well, that should be easy enough to find. Sure. I mean, how big can a country be? Pretty. It was an electronic pretty, pretty map big. of the world. Ley lines were represented in red. They all merged at one point over Egypt. The panel was made of wood. I couldn't see any way of opening yeah, it. Yeah, that was the secret entrance. But the release mechanism had to be somewhere in the room. The desk was too heavy to move. Boo. And besides, we needed to find a way to follow after Bruno. Fine, let's get the scene for up. It was a map of some small country in Europe. I couldn't make out where, though. Maybe it was Cesaro's homeland. I would never be able to fit into that armor. Well, in any case, nuts. what good would it do me if I could? I imagined myself taking them with me, but then Being I thought alive. better of it. Hmm. Books on Book. Egypt and Egyptian culture. It would take months to trawl through this and decipher it all. Cesaro's desk was straight out of the megalomaniac catalog. Aha! Look at this. What is it? Secret button hidden under the edge of the desk. Son of a bitch. Maybe it opens the door. Well, let's give it a shot. The desk was too heavy to move. Damn. If the world ends when I press View this, adjustment. then I'm sorry for also, all the nasty Nico's things I've ever said about you. Walking. George, just get on just with it. Continuously walking okay, into the chair sorry. Right it's a very awkward view. Well done, George. Let's go and rescue Bruno. Oh. Out of interest, what nasty things? Oh, you know, the usual. The usual? Go on. Ugh. Nah, I think I'm going to just run through the opening here. Oh. 
And she took the win. Ah, oh, we were too late. No. Andre, what are you doing here? I uh, thought I'd keep Beatrice company. Andre took me to the cinema. What did you see, Nosferatu? George. Andre, we need your help. Of course. What do you want him to do? That symbol on the scarf? Yes. Cesaro recognized it instantly. It's the coat of arms of the St. Stephen chapter of the Templars. My god. What? I always thought it was just a story. Look, Andre, tell us what you know. Tell us, chérie. The St. Stephen chapter was reputed to have escaped the Inquisition by hiding in secret chambers. Somewhere in Paris. No one knew where, though previously they had their base near the old church at Montfaucon. Maybe I can find a clue in the old Templar meeting place. What do you mean? The Templars used to meet in secret in the catacombs there. Of course. There's more. Go on. It involves the founding of the chapter. We don't have time for tales, Andre. Listen, Nico. If there's one thing I've come to realize, it's that you can't have too much information. Carry on, Andre. I mean, you could. Thank you, George. <laughs> you could have when the Templars were in possession of the Temple Mount in Israel, they discovered a holy relic. A young knight, Stefan, was given the task of transporting it secretly to France. He traveled north through Galilee and then headed to the coast where he boarded a ship destined for the river Po. Making his way up the Po Valley, Stefan avoided known dangers to the west by heading north to the Rheingau. Pursued into France by the forces of a treasure hunting prince, he was forced to make a stand in the mountains of Reims. Though able to dispose of his foes, he was fatally wounded. Bravely, he continued to his destination, the Berantoir Preceptory, handed the relic to the his master of the chapter, so then died. The order changed his name to Saint Stéphane, in honor of the brave Sometimes knight, visually looks and really relocated to it's Paris. In, it's it's like out. a fairy tale. It Good grief. Like, like she looks I'm like going butt, to head for Montfaucon. But he looks look pretty clues. good. Nico? You go without me, George. Andre and I will see if we can work out the exact location in Egypt. Right. Well, um, I'll see you soon then. Off you go, George. I was back in Montfaucon Square after all these years. Beneath the cobbles lay a hidden world of ancient waterways and catacombs. Like Some of it built square. by the Knights this Templar was, as a meeting this place. This was an sanctuary. area in the second market I remember. It. I was going to have to go down there to this, discover the truth. This cafe, this church, like, we keep coming back to this area. Speaking of coming back to this area, uh, this is actually where I'm probably going to call it a day. I have no idea what's about that. Okay. So yeah, this is where I'm going to call it for today's stream. Uh, I thank everyone for joining me for uh, some Broken Sword action today. Like I said, if you've enjoyed what you've seen, please hit that follow button to know the next time I'm streaming. Uh, Sundays are Smash Sundays for those of you who are wanting to play some Smash Brothers or uh, stream, or sorry, see me play Smash Brothers or play against me in some Smash Brothers. Um, I'll try to have... Uh, like a room open that anybody can join in. I may do some randos online if nobody's joining the room, but um, if you're here for Smash Brothers gameplay, check me out on Sundays. Um, there may be random pop-ups uh, depending on the day of the week. Uh, my schedule is all over the place for my real job. Um, or Sorry, not my real job, but my day job. Uh, or my full-time gig, you could say. Um, so sometimes my streams may be all over the place and when they start so I may do a random one here and there throw some smash matches in there uh, I'll also be playing uh, possibly some other games in the future I might stick to this game until I get through it just so I can say I've completed it uh, we'll see I'll, I'll gauge it case by case but please join me next time this has been Wody's World and I'll see you in the next one peace